Hello Capricorn, welcome to another love reading. This one will be regarding the person you're thinking about or connecting with at this time. How are they viewing you or this connection? What are their feelings towards you? Um, what are their intentions towards you? And what do they wish they could tell you? We're going to look at all of that today. So let's jump right in. For Capricorn, spirits, angels, guides, messages, please, guidance. For Capricorn regarding love and the person that they are thinking about or connecting with at this time. Spirit, what does Capricorn need to know about their person? What does Capricorn need to know about the person they are in a connection with at this time? What do we need to know about this person that Capricorn is dealing with? What do we need to know about this person that Capricorn is I have changed. Okay. And I can't let you go at the bottom of the deck there. Okay. What else? What else do we need to know about this person? Spirit, what else do we need to know about this person? What are their energies towards Capricorn? What are their energies towards Capricorn? The eagle. Wow. Pretty sure the eagle is like karmic fire or something like that. Um, let me just double check because I always confuse the eagle with the hawk. Yeah, transforms karma. You'll soon be thrown into the karmic fire for the sake of your transformation. Okay, so I have changed an ego and now it makes sense. So this person has been through it is what I'm getting here. They probably have been dealing with a karmic situation or karma has bitten them in the butt and they've learned a huge lesson. Okay, what else do we need to know about this person? What else do we need to know about this person that Capricorn is or will be dealing with? What do we need to know? Oh my gosh, I have learned from my mistakes. <laughs> Didn't we have a reading like this recently for you? I wish I could go back in time. Man. I can't let you go. I wish I could go back in time. I've learned my mistake, Capricorn, is what this person's thinking. This person really, it did not go well for them. Whatever happened here. It did not go well for them. Okay, can I get one more for this person that Capricorn is will be dealing with? What do we need to know about this person? What do we need to know about this person? You speak to me through music. So they're probably listening to music and thinking about you. We need to let each other go. You're right. You tell me you can't let go. So this person, I feel like they, they battle with themselves, I think. It was my fault, but I blamed you. Wow. The tables have turned. I feel like this person wishes they could just let you go so that they could have peace with themselves. Maybe this is what you're telling them. Like, let's just move on. Okay. Can I get some more insight, please? Into this person's energy. This person at Capricorn is dealing with. What do we need to know about this person's spirit? What do we need to know about this person's energies towards Capricorn? Let's see what we find out here. Ten of Pentacles in their, um, what their energies, thoughts, or feelings for you with the Eight of Pentacles reverse. Nope, sorry. Six of Pentacles reverse. Okay, what are their intentions? Next action is going to be the Magician. Okay, so they're motivated. King of Cups reverse. Okay, by heartbreak. <laughs> um, emotionally, this poor, this person is torn up. What do you need to know? Any hidden factors? The Hangman. Okay. Yeah, it's almost like a back and forth. The Magician and the Hangman. Very different energies. Yeah, Page of Wands reverse. So this is somebody that I feel... Is, is conflicted, uh, Capricorn. What's at the bottom of the deck? Four of Wands. Nice. So I feel like this person, um, 
you you brought some sort of stability to their life or when they think about you they think about you know a happy ending of some sort marriage perhaps having a happy home domestic bliss etc but i think what's going on with this person is that they are emotionally back and forth all over the place here this is somebody that is conflicted um, because I feel that they've learned their mistakes, but, and this is a, um, a common theme for your readings, Capricorn, um, and check out your playlist. I have all of the playlists for each sign linked in the description box, but you've had readings before where you have changed Capricorn. And so the way that you approach this person or this connection is not the same. So they might have learned from, they may have learned from their mistakes, but you learned from your mistakes as well. So it might not be so simple for this person. Um, and I think they wish they could go back in time because they know that this is not going to be easy for them. You know, maybe they screwed it up a little bit too much. Um, okay, so let's see, let's get into this 10 of Pentacles, six of Pentacles reverse. There's an imbalance with the six of Pentacles reverse. Um, the give and take is not equal. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here with the Six of Pentacles reverse? Seven of Cups, okay. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here with the Six of Pentacles reverse? Eight of Pentacles. The world, okay. So... When it comes to you, Capricorn, when this person thinks about you, when it comes to their feelings for you, I think in their mind, they're trying to figure out how they can make this work. How can they, how can they bring back the balance? How can they work on this with you or work together with you? Um, have a 10 of pentacles, four of wands. I feel like that's your person's goal is to have what they lost or to have what they, you know, they wish they could go back in time. So maybe they want to return to what they used to have with you. But that's going to take some effort. And they know it with the Eight of Pentacles, the Three of Pentacles. That's going to take effort. Um, so when it comes to feelings, I think they're very clear on the goal. Like they're very clear on what they want, what they are hoping to achieve. But then when it comes to their intentions slash actions, I feel, or the hidden factors here with the intentions are in slash actions next to it, I feel like there's a, there, these two are opposites, right? We have the magician, and then here we have the hangman and the page of wands reverse. Literally stuck energy. Someone that takes one step forward and two steps back. That's the page of wands reverse. So it's almost like they, they step forward to approach this problem with gusto right and then <laughs> once they get there they're like i don't think that's that's the best plan and they back up they, they backtrack you know tell me about the magician and the king of cups reverse tell me about the magician and the king of cups reverse nine of cups i keep getting the nine of cups in these readings tell me about the magician and the king of cups reverse judgment Tell me about the Magician and the King of Cups reverse. Queen of Swords. So I feel like this person does want a second chance here. Queen of Wands, Five of Cups. Interesting. <laughs> Eight of Wands, Knight of Cups. Yeah, so this person, it's like they want to tell you how bad how badly they feel, how much they regret. They might even want to apologize to you. I feel like you're looking extra good right now, Capricorn. I feel like you have this like, pop, probably like a post breakup glow up. I don't know why I'm saying it like that because I don't talk like that usually, but that's that's the message, I'm, I'm that's what I'm hearing. Like a glow up, like you're glowing, literally glowing. Some of you, okay, um, some of you, and this is not going to be for all of you, but some of you are doing like, um, like either you graduating from a course, graduating from a program or like promoted at work. And this person knows for some reason. I think seeing you do so good, it doesn't sit right with this person. 
And I say that because the King of Cups is reversed, the Six of Pentacles is reversed. I feel like this person's very unbalanced internally, like emotionally. They are, it's, it's, there's something about you doing well without them that just doesn't really sit right with them or it makes them feel even worse. It's like the guilt, right? The guilt, the regret. And that's why I feel like this person deep down is like, I wish I just didn't care, you know? Because you're the Queen of Swords, I feel this person knows that to have a second chance with you would not be easy here. You're doing well, you're, you're looking good, but at the same time, it's like your boundaries are in place. Yeah, this person is like really into you. Okay, same energy at the bottom of the deck. Tell me about judgment. I think you still care about this person, but you don't show it. Tell me about judgment. Tell me about judgment, spirit. Yeah, so this person would love to talk about things. Um, maybe they want to come over, visit you, talk about, you know, this second chance with you. Cancer energy with the chariot. But the hidden factor or what you should know is that even though this is the intention, I feel like it's either going to take a while or this person is like back and forth. Why is the hangman here with the page of wands reverse? Why is the hangman here with the page of wands reverse? Six of cups. Why is the hangman here with the page of wands reverse? The magician again. Why is the hangman here with the page of wands reverse? The devil, Capricorn energy. There you are. Page of Cups at the bottom of the deck, Knight of Swords. I mean, I feel bad because this person's energy is so clear. Look at this. The goal is clear. They're really working on this, on manifesting this. They really want this. But I feel like the past is the problem or you are the problem. And I don't mean like there's something wrong with you, Capricorn. But I mean, like, I don't feel like you're willing to play with this person. Or I don't think you're willing to give this person the time of day, you know? And so since you're not open to this, then this can't happen. You know what I mean? So you're kind of a block for this person in a way. Can I get some information, please, on the devil? Tell me more about the devil. Why is the devil here? Two of Wands. Why is the devil here? Page of Cups. Yeah, this person is almost like, should I, shouldn't I? With the Two of Wands, I feel like their decision has not been made. Should I approach Capricorn? I mean, yeah. And then I have the King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So it's like this person is like really thinking with their heart here. We have the Six of Swords after that. I feel like they would have to visit you or this is like what they want to do. It wouldn't surprise me if they like drove by or asked other people about you or like try to be in the same place as you are accidentally, you know? Tell me more about the Six of Cups. Tell me more about the Six of Cups. And you know, look at all this energy on the board. I mean, when it comes to me clarifying your person's energy, it's all so like positive in a way. You know, how do I make this happen? I want a new beginning. I want a second chance. I want, I want to talk to Capricorn. I want to tell them how I feel. I want to tell them I've changed. You know, I'm really serious about this with the magician. I really want to get this done, but I'm scared. And also, what if they don't take me back? This tale is all this time, right? Because like this is this person, they wish they could go back in time for a reason. Once again, I'm just repeating myself here. I feel like this page of cups is an apology. Yeah, let's um, 10 of cups again, four of wands, very similar energy. If I apologize to Capricorn, then I get my happy ending. I get my nine of cups, I get my 10 of cups. Yeah, ace of cups. Bottom of the deck, I have the eight of swords. So yes, this is just very clear energy, Capricorn. Um, I really don't feel like I need to clarify more on your person's energies because they are their energy is very strong very focused 
Um, I feel like this person wants to convince you that they've changed, that they've learned from their mistakes, that they want to do a do-over. But I think it's not so simple. I think facing you is very difficult. Yeah, Four of Cups after that is like, you know, rejection is very a very real possibility for this person. And I think they know it. And I don't think they could even blame you for that, you know? So that's what I have for you, Capricorn. I hope this uh, reading resonated. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, please consider liking, subscribing. If you want to see more videos from me, thank you so much for all of your comments, your support. I really appreciate it. And I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.